morning everybody. It's been a little while since we put a kitten video out and we're very overdue for this litter. So here we have Alphabet seven kittens and I've just moved them into their playpen for litter training. They are just over four weeks old so we are getting into this pen a little bit late. But um, mainly the reason for the delay is these guys have just been so grubby. I've still got a few little faces to wash, but they just get so grubby. And I mean, we always want to present a really nice, clean picture to everybody watching, but reality is kittens are very messy <laughs> and some litters are far worse than others. And big litters are usually even worse than that. So litter of seven has been quite quite a task and alphabet's over here Woo! so she's doing doing well for anyone wondering hello she's just had some breakfast meow meows oh is that tasty <laughs> so this is the first time i've actually eat, seen them eat solid food so I probably should have given them a bigger plate. I didn't think they would just dive into it like this. Oh, I've got somebody here. You've got a grubby face. I'm going to go in there, Alphabet. So I would have, um, if you've seen any of my other videos, you'd know I always have the top of the playpen open so mums can go in and out as they like pretty much to get away from these guys because they can be quite quite full on looks like we've had our first little wee in the tray and though mummy's over here there you go. God, look at it just walk over. I think it's standing on that one and now it's eating. <laughs> oh, goodness. Oh, well, that might have been an alphabet wee, but in a way it's quite good because then they will know where the right place to go is. Good girl. And we have three girls and four boys in this litter. And so far I'm still trying to pick the tabbies, but we have at least two tabbies in this litter, one of each gender. just taken their food away or well, they've just finished with it and alphabet's gone in there to feed them but they're so interested and so friendly they're more interested in seeing what I'm doing <laughs> hello we've got some faces to clean gonna let you listen to their conversations <laughs> it's a big job seven kittens there's one here
So Alphabet's had enough. Out she goes. And these guys should have a, a play or a sleep. Whoops. Hey kids. They would love to follow, but very important to get their bit of training done. So I'm not going to go through each single kitten because honestly, I can't actually tell who some of them are just yet. And they're looking a little bit on the, the grubby side. So we'll probably give it another week or so. Hello, before we introduce each one. Whoops, Daisy into the water. By then they usually have a better handle on their grooming. They're actually very clean on their bodies. It's just the face and it's just the grub around her teats, like the oil, the grease from the skin. So as sort of as much as we try and keep her and them clean, it's just a phase and age thing. And some litters don't get it at all. So you're having fun over there. So if you are a breeder or a new breeder and you have a litter and you're seeing a lot of like milk staining brown on their faces, it, it's actually quite normal. It's frustrating for photos because they always look a little bit dirty, but it, yeah, it can be quite normal. And as long as we just do the best we can to help the mums keep them clean, it's okay. So you can sort of see this one. Hello, you're looking very, very grubby. So I'll just clean off the bit on top of its nose. Hello, and yours too. Oh, this one wants to play. So yeah, if you've got any questions about this litter, comment below. I'll do my best to answer everybody. And we are getting quite a lot of questions, so I, I do a few each morning as best I can because I'd rather give a good answer than just a, a one-worder. But yeah, if you've got any any questions about these kittens, about Alphabet, um, please feel welcome to ask. Oh, we've got somebody with an opinion here. Oopsie daisy, there we go. And their water gets changed very, very frequently because they walk through it a lot. Now we'll go on the outside. Oh dear. I'll, uh, I'll leave it there, but I'll take a bit of a kitten montage for you to watch them play and I'll probably come back in when they're asleep as well. This one's got some beans. Yeah. A lot of them just want to get out and explore. Very soon, once we're litter trained, and we'll have another video out very soon, probably on uh, cupcakes litter. I can't believe it, but they're very soon they'll be ready to go. All right, bye bye, kittens.